Hi guys, welcome to my channel. And basically this is gonna be about um my weave and my experience with AliExpress weave. Basically, I'm taking out my weave today, so I'm just gonna show you guys how I'm taking it out and kind of describe to you guys my experience with the weave from AliExpress. So let's just get right into it. Good job, that was nice. Okay, so basically I ordered three bundles from Al it's called Ali Coco on AliExpress. I ordered um virgin um 100% human hair. When I got it in the package in the mail, it came pretty quick, which was pretty good. The buyer, I mean the um, supplier, she messages me, she messaged me and she just made sure that I got the right product and all that stuff and whatever. And then um I got it and it was like it seemed right like the hair I could tell it was real. Like it just seemed proper and I'm not like I don't know if I have a lot of a lot of experience with like weave and stuff like that because I've only done it this would have been my second time putting in weave or bundles. But like it seemed like it was pretty good, like it was um good enough hair. And if you look at it now, I just brushed it out and this is the best like it's looked. Like it's been about three weeks since I put this hair in. And it's extremely dry and it seems pretty ratty. It looks like it's fake. If I wasn't to brush it out, it would be like, I don't even know how to explain it, but like really ratty and just, um, it just looks really dry and fake. And I'm pretty upset about that. I don't know what it is. Like if um, they just didn't give me like good enough hair or if it was like part of it was synthetic or anything like that. Or maybe I'm just not enough experienced, I'm not experienced enough and this is what's supposed to happen when you put in weave, but I'm pretty sure it's not supposed to because I've known people who've kept in weave for like a really long time and it hasn't turned out like that. So um, basically today I'm going to be taking it out and see what is going on under all of these bundles here. How I'm going to start is I'm going to brush this out where my leave out is. So um, I'm just gonna grab corner all the way down here. If you don't know how to corner, you could really just braid it and then just um, bobby pin it back or um, use an elastic. Brush out the edges. Yeah, this is gonna annoy me, so I'm just gonna bobby pin it back. Okay, so first thread. See? Now we've got this coming out. <sighs> okay, hi guys. This is my hair after I've taken it all out. It's just, I don't know. This is all the weave. Like, it's just a mess. It's really just a mess. Yeah, I'm gonna go wash this and um, hopefully rejuvenate all my curls. Okay, hi guys. So, um, I am back from my shower. Um, I was pretty worried before that um, the front of my hair, like all my curls would be gone, but they pretty much went back to normal. So now I'm just gonna put in a bunch of products and style my hair for tomorrow because I have to wake up really early for a class tomorrow and I am gonna be too tired to do my hair. So I'm just gonna do a high bun. Um, yeah, let me show you guys how I do that. So products you're going to need for this Eco Styling Gel. Castor oil here too as well. I am going to put it in my roots of my hair because it's been pretty dry since it's been in the weave. And I haven't really gotten any oil into my scalp. So I'm going to use that just to oil up my scalp a bit. And then I'm going to use the Ke Curl Keeper Leave-In Conditioner. Um, since it softens rough dry hair, um, this is the leave-in conditioner that I'm going to use to put in my hair. Also, I'm going to use this 30 second detangler. So this product is called the Curl Keeper Slip. It's a 30 second detangler. Um, oh, I have a huge forehead. <laughs> Thanks for that. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Did I get you wet? Alright, so I'm not really fancy and I don't really have one of those um those curl like <laughs> for I don't know what I'm talking about those curl like like you know like when you go like this with your hair and then it's like a blow dryer attached to like the hand <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about I don't know what it's called but I'm not fancy and I don't have that so I have a basic blow dryer I'm gonna put this leave-in conditioner after I just dry this just a little bit because it's soaking wet right now so <laughs> So now I'm going to put in this conditioner. It smells really good. It's not like 
um you know those really heavy conditioners where it sort of feels like it's just weighing down your hair this is really light but it still feels as if it's moisturizing my hair really well all right so i've moisturized this now i need to dry my hair a little bit more before i'm able to get it into a bun <laughs> guys so i'm pretty much done blow drying my hair i'm gonna take i don't know what you call this brush but <laughs> i just call it a hard brush basically and then you're gonna brush up your hair into the bun style that you want okay then you're gonna grab your style <laughs> my hair looks crazy then you're gonna grab your eco style gel and slap that on your head Grab your elastic and pull your hair up. You can really leave this as an out ponytail, but I don't want to. I grab a bit of the hair, pull it up, and then I'm going to bobby pin that right into place. Alright guys, so um, this would be my final look. <laughs> so this is the final look after taking out all of this hair and then um, washing, rejuvenating my hair with all these products and then putting it into a high bun. Oh, and the last step would be before you go to bed. I'm just about to go to the cafe to go eat real quick, so I'm going to put this on later. But basically, you just wrap your hair like this. This part will go under here, and you're just going to wrap this and tie it at the back. And go to sleep and wake up in the morning, and you should be set to go wherever you need to go without having to spend however long this took me. I think this took me, like, 30 minutes after washing my hair just to do the bun. So, yeah. So, thank you guys for tuning in. Um, please hit the subscribe button down below. I'll be putting all the products that I used on my putting all the products I use on my hair down below in the description and um please hit the like button and um subscribe okay thank you guys for tuning in and I'll catch you guys in the next video